Good afternoon. You finished your labs, classes, papers, dissertations, projects, and presentations. I don't know about you, but who's ready for a nap? All right, no naps right now. We've got some things to do. One of the reasons I'm ready for a nap is because of all the noise. Everywhere we turn, there's noise. The sound of overheated rhetoric, social media, TV pundits, talk show hosts, television radio, even occasionally at social gatherings. Yes, I enjoy a robust debate as much as any faculty member does, and big problems deserve big debates. But sometimes, don't you just yearn for a civil conversation rather than an angry argument? Isn't there any place for unity despite our individual differences? Well, on a day like today, it's part of my job, our job, to convey hope. So let me offer three places of refuge as you transition to your next opportunity. First, there's your family and friends. Now, before you laugh too hard thinking about the recent disastrous family gathering, focus on the people in this room. Loved ones who drove or flew, in some cases, hundreds of miles, just to be here with you on your special day. No, you don't agree on everything, but when times are tough, chances are, when you need to make a call, you can always count on someone who is in this room, or maybe back home, for love and support, rather than a fight. And isn't that comforting? Second, there are your service organizations. The College of Engineering has roughly one student organization for every 10 graduates in this room. At the university's other student organizations, and the ratio is close to one to one. The reason for the large number of groups is all of you have varying interests you are passionate about, which thrive in outlets beyond the classroom and beyond the lab. You've either joined a group that meets a need or created one yourself. Of course, you have disagreements with your fellow group members, but your sense of shared purpose is bigger. Your connection bridges, bridges these divides, so don't let the end of the academic journey be the end of that relationship. Finally, there's Michigan. Now, it is possible you've had some of the most heated arguments of your life at or about this university. But with one simple phrase, all Wolverines instantly unite. Crush Ohio State. <laughs> Even if you aren't a big sports fan, you understand we have something special that connects us. We are Michigan and Michigan engineers. The Q, the Do, the R, the Grove, the Maze, the Blue, and so much more. When you leave this campus, you will realize even more than you do now that the bond of the Block M is worldwide and very deep. And unlike your family or other service organizations, we won't get upset if you don't call us. Trust me, we'll call you. <laughs> I mean that. So stay connected to your family and friends, to your service community, and to this amazing university. Congratulations, class of 2017. Go Blue. <laughs>